to be inside an, a network this size. It truly is. You can't even touch that. You know, you just can't. So people make their words <laughs> and it's up to us whether or not we want to keep them inside. Did anybody else, when she said you can't touch that, think of MC Hammer? Yeah. <laughs> okay, cool. <laughs> oh, yeah, we all grew up in that era. Absolutely. Yeah, yeah. It's yeah. not just me. Great, great, great. Yeah. So, um, is this go- and this book is so exciting. Definitely do it. Um, are you gonna Are you gonna put the person's messages and their? Is it gonna be a collection of? It's gonna be my top ten tips and like top 10 ever that i've i've kept in my mind for like the last you know years i've been doing this and it will be so and the thing is like i give that information you know every week you know i just did a talk with you in london right yeah and so if people are giving you this advice let alone they're giving it to you for free let's not even talk about that (laughs) like they're giving it to you for free it's up to you whether or not you're going to take it in Mm. I mean, that's what I have uh, two mentors on LinkedIn that have been with me when I started with like a thousand followers and I'm still deeply loyal to them. And I believe in passing that ladder down and I'm trying to teach people, hey, if somebody gave you advice, someone helped you, please pass it down to the next group of people. That's crucial. I am not making this introduction on a formal basis, but as a soon-to-be-published author, Rachel, uh, Julie up there, she's in top right. Yeah. Do you know each other? No, Julie, we've Uh, we've never met. Oh, cool. Okay. Uh, Oh, man. Of course. We're recording. I won't edit this out, but but, yeah, because I didn't realize... I know everyone. Oh, if I've met Jack, Jackie, have we met? Yeah, him? yeah. Okay, say hi, everyone. Say hi. hi. We have a nice to meet you, Rachel. Nice, nice to meet you. Rachel. So yeah. Julie is a four times best-selling author. Did you say four times or five times? No. <laughs> How many times? Twice. Okay. Congratulations. I four as well. I, yeah. Was it you, Jackie? Who's done four? Not me. I'm going mad. And, 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 and. Right. <laughs> okay. You're, prophesi- you're prophesying. Um, <laughs> yes. Possibly, yeah. Yeah, that, yeah, it could well be. So, um, Jackie. Okay. Absurd. So, we've looked at absurd like someone with a sales email offering you whatever um uh, think of something random um they're gonna get you leads on tap and sell yes yeah or build your coaching business Mm -hmm. what other sort of absurd uh approaches have you had i think i've had the i've had the the big brand name email saying you know you've been an incredible winner of this prize, this hundreds of thousands of dollars, interestingly, and I'm here in the UK, but you know, look that side. Um, and then just, you know, provide your bank details and we'll get this transfer. I'm like, really, 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 really? I mean, can that possibly ever work for anybody? I don't know. That's probably the most ridiculous types of emails that I would get. You. That is ridiculous. If you go and look at the, uh, the sender, of the email it's like brand name at xwq174 something something yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. dot net and it's like you didn't even try yeah <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> well that's something i tell people right i took my phone number and my email off my profile about a year and a half about a year ago about a year and a half and that was that limited you know when people ask me it's a different story and then i'll decide whether or not i'm going to give them my phone number or i'm going to give them my email because people tend, and I've discussed it too, they tend to, to subscribe us to stuff that we didn't even want. Mm-hmm. And so that that's, I always tell people like, that's on you. You know, if you want to have your email up on your profile, you want to have your phone number, it's you, you have to create those boundaries. 